Here we are in Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania, where the Pittsburgh Vipers will take on the Napoli Neapolitans in tonight's semifinals. Best of three matchup here in season number nine of the Slapshot Premier League. Welcome one and all to the SPL Network. My name is Darth Taxil. Let's get right into the nitty gritty of it and learn about the players that will be on the ice for this one. For the visiting team, the Napoli Neapolitans finished the season with a hefty record of 11-5-2. They have a call to fame here tonight. Whether or not fate will answer it is up to the three that will be starting here tonight. Now Noah, Ajayman, Moy getting accustomed to one another. Of course, Hero might be on call here tonight as well for the boys in teal, but uh, only time will tell who the starting three will be. Um, did not get really any confirmation from either of the captains on who they have in mind to start, but we can make assumptions based off the stats, and we'll get more into that here in a few moments. But uh, Ajayman, Moy didn't not start the last season he's this is his first season with the Neapolitans he's really felt at home play last season with the Ocean City Typhoons um, Typhoons rebranded into the Los Angeles Leopards with T Mace and Ridge at the forefront of their organization um, a J-Man boy flip to the flip to the flip to the ice cream team and uh, he's really made himself at home he's been one of the more proficient players one of the bigger X factors here this season and uh, he's going to have to show up in a big way here tonight if they are in fact to win um, to win this game would be a uh, greater feat than dethroning Matt Turk in Mike Tyson's Punch-Out. If you understand that reference at all, you will understand that it is no easy task. Pittsburgh Vipers finished the season with a 17-1 record. Their only loss coming to the hands of the Plymouth Plague, if my memory serves me correct. Yager captaining the boys, taking it over from Eli earlier on in the season. Followed along Milk Crooks. Josiah and Seaman. Seaman also played for the Neapolitans once upon a time earlier here in season number nine. Uh, he turned to the dark side, some people say, depending on who you root for. Some of you um, are a little excited for that. Pittsburgh Vipers got themselves a hold of some good talent up in the Pro Division. Whether or not he plays a night will be unlikely. But um, with that being said, taking a look at our odd shot players to watch here tonight. For the Neapolitans, I have Noah, the top goal scorer from their hockey club. 52 goals were scored, 87 points on the regular season. He's played the offensive side of the puck uh, almost second to none. Very few players were able to outdo his offensive abilities in the pro division here this season. And uh, he's going to be the man to watch in the teal jerseys here tonight. On the flip side of that coin, Crooks from the Pittsburgh Vipers had a heck of a season, topping the points chart in all of the pro division with 114 Apples, mostly. Most of them were assists. It's got to be said, got to be noted, he's only scored 39 of those 114 points, but uh, he passes the puck a lot. He leads his team in all th all four of those, or uh, all three of those lower categories. He's played every game that he could for the Pittsburgh Vipers. 61 saves also tops his team in terms of saves, tops his teams in ter terms of points, and uh, the goal scoring comes from another uh, side of the ice, but... Uh, Crooks is the man to watch for Pittsburgh. He's going to be the rock. He's going to be the foundation here tonight. And uh, if he if he is shaky, I don't know if Pittsburgh will have an easy of a, of a time as they think they will uh, walking into a matchup like this. Of course, tonight it is a best of three. It is the pro semifinals. Winner goes on to play the Plymouth Plague in the finals. So, uh... If we do go all three uh, legs of this race here tonight, it'll be the first time in this season's playoff stint. Of course, the Neapolitans came off a victory uh, a few weeks ago at this point against the Kota Cook Stars. Game one going their way 6-5, and then game two they swept the Stars 5-4. Of course, they were the lower seed out of those two middle-of-the-bracket players. Uh, that was the fourth and the fifth seed, the Neapolitans being the fifth seed in the playoffs. Um, they're going to be up against a hard one here tonight. Pittsburgh Vipers finishing first in the Pro Division. They are the team to beat. And if they do, in fact, get beat here tonight, uh, the finals will be a very interesting uh, story to tell. Of course, Plymouth Plague, the defending champions, they're going for their four-peat here this season, going back to back to back to back. Will they be able to do it? Will they find an extinguisher here this season with the Vipers on the other side of the ice, or will it be the Neapolitans? That's the answer we're here to find out here tonight. Plymouth Plague had one of the most demanding wins in the playoff series so far, finding a mercy roll in Game 1 against the New Jersey Noobs, 11-1, to and that second game almost repeating history 11 to 4 was the result of that game uh the noobs showed up they had a great time i don't think their uh their morale ever faltered during that matchup and they're just here for the vibes and i uh i commend new jersey for it but um tonight's the boys in the teal it's the boys in the blue and the red well uh i'll make sure to keep you guys updated whenever they file into the lobby just so it's stated for the record we keep track of that one pretty uh pretty nifty but i uh, take a look at what the players have done so far here in the season what their stats were at the end of the regular season the pittsburgh vipers groups on top of the ball on almost all the categories yager and milk having 57 goals apiece at the end of the regular season tied for best on their team and uh well the Pittsburgh Vipers, the only team, if my memory serves me correctly, to have multiple players, at least two, with over 100 points in the regular season. 
Uh, you can kind of see the difference at the bottom of the totals of what their uh, what their total output was in each of the departments. The Neapolitans once again having Meow, one of the most prolific save makers in the Slapshot Premier League and the world. Um, I think he is close to holding the world record for most saves in a pro uh, pro season out of the SPL, which is the North American League, the EUSL, which is the European League, and the OSL, which is the Australian League, or the Oceanic League, my bad. Um, but Meow knows how to stop the puck. He's very calm with it. Uh, the word around the grapevine for the past umpteen seasons, as long as he's been in SPL, is he does not have the, the stop button bound to his controller. Um, whether or not that's true or not, I'd like to believe it is. You can dig into the facts yourself if you uh, if you doubt my, my knowledge of the game. Um, but if Meow does in fact does not doesn't have the stop button bound, it proves that uh, you can save the puck no matter what your control scheme is and what, as long as you have the will and the drive to do it, um, you can get her done, as uh, Larry the Cable Guy once said. But uh, Meow, uh, looking at the record table, he has the fifth most saves made in a single season last season, season number eight of the Slapshot Premier League. He had 167 saves and 27 blocks in 18 games played. He was only outdone by a few of the goaltenders from the, uh, the European Slapshot League back in seasons one through three. Nobody has done it in recent memory except for Meow to have a high enough save record as he did last season. This season, a little bit lower. It's not 167, but it is in fact 90, and he is the uh, the, the stone wall of the Pro Division once again. Um, so uh, he's making a name for himself. He's calling himself up there for the fame of it, and uh, we're going to see exactly how good his defense is here tonight um, as we uh, get this one underway here in a few moments. Yager and Milk were the, two of the top five goal scorers, fifth being Noah. Noah had 52 goals, as you can see on your screen. Milk and Yager were tied for third place in terms of goals with 57. Only people to outdo them was Blue from the Kota Cook Stars with 68, and Hex from the Plymouth Plague with 70. Um, and there were only, I think, five players total to uh, break. No, there's only been four players total to break the 100-point marker. Two of them playing for the Pittsburgh Vipers tonight. Milk was number five in points. Hex was fourth with an even... Um, Milk was fifth place with points with 95. Hex from the Plymouth Plague was fourth place with 100 points. Blue from the Stars with 108. And then, of course, Yager and Crooks on your screen. 109 for Yager in second. Crooks with 114 for first. So uh, the softest hands, the hardest shot, the carry... All going to be here tonight alongside the stone wall for Napoli. It's going to be a good one, going to be a grand one here tonight, and it's going to be an interesting one. Uh, taking a look out, just because we can, uh, taking a look at the standings as they were at the end of the regular season. The Pittsburgh Vipers finished first place. They'll be taking on the fifth seed here tonight as uh, the Neapolitans would end up playing against the fourth seed in the quarterfinals. They will have themselves the harder task of taking on the first seed since they are on that side of the bracket. But, uh... Out of the four main divisions we have in the Slapshot Premier League here for season number nine, this is the best of the best. This is the cream of the crop. This is going to show you what we have in our back wallet in terms of skill, sportsmanship, and uh, fizzazz, for lack of a better term. But Meow, Chef, um, Noah in the lobby for the Neapolitans, Yager, Crooks, Milk, and Seaman in the lobby for the Pittsburgh Vipers. Both teams getting warmed up. Both teams getting ready to go. Um, taking a look at the last time these teams have played against one another. Uh, the first time this season was on May 4th. Uh, the Pittsburgh Vipers took a mercy roll out against the Neapolitans, 12-2. Pittsburgh Vipers had um, Crooks with four goals, Yager with three, Milk with five for the total of 12. Hero and Noah had themselves one apiece, and Meow was the third man on the ice, had a point and six saves on the night. So Noah J-Man boy in the first matchup. Second matchup, um, a little bit different, a little bit different vibe, but uh, the same outcome did persist. Pittsburgh Vipers found a 13-3 victory over the Neapolitans on May 24th. I casted both of these games. If you want to go back and look at them on the archive channel, you are welcome to. Uh, for the Neapolitans, their goal scorers were two from Chef J-Man Boy, one from Meow, and Noah had a goose egg, unfortunately. Noah had a very strange stat line. His only real calling card were, were his 13 passes and 11 seconds of possession time uncontested. On the flip side of the coin for the Pittsburgh Vipers, Crooks had two goals, Yager had eight, and Milk had three for the total of 13 over the Neapolitan three. But both these teams very accustomed to each other in the Pro Division. Everybody plays everybody twice. Their two times went to the Vipers' tally. As you can see, the Vipers only having one loss during the regular season. Um, this is going to be this is going to be one of the toughest tasks that the Neapolitans have ever faced in their slap shot history. So we'll see what they got here in a few moments. Yager, Crooks, Milk starting for the Pittsburgh Vipers. Meow, a J-Man boy, and Noah starting for the Neapolitans. But uh, whatever both these teams have for us here tonight, I'm sure it's going to be a beautiful matchup, going to be a beautiful series here tonight. Of course, it is still 
a best of two or a best two out of three. So the first team to claim two victories will move on into the finals to take on the Plymouth Plague. But uh, that all starts right here, right now. All six parties in the lobby, ready to rock. All six parties in the lobby, ready to roll. Pittsburgh Vipers on the right side of your screen in the red. The Neapolitans on the left side of your screen in the teal. The puck has dropped. The game is on and time is underway for the first time here in this series. Krooks here with the puck down to the near side, lobs it to a little bit of open ice, finds his way over to Milk. Milk back over top side over to Krooks. Krooks here with an out, chops it near side, finds Milk. Milk trying to find a little bit of elbow, elbow room to work with. Forehand shot, nice stop there by Meow. Meow throws that one down the ice on the money, but Milk there to stop it at the red line. No, and knocks it loose. Yager near side trying to pull this one away for the boys in red. Here's Krooks top side, here's Milk with it now. Forehand shooting near side and wide. Yager picking it back up to the point. Krooks here. Off the forehand, finds Yager once more. Fans on it. Back to the defensive side. Here's Krooks with it now. Krooks cuts to the near side. Loosened it up. Meow knocks it farther southways. Yager in the corner trying to find a passing lane to open up. Off to the far side. Gets it off the back end. Milk with it now. Back end. In the crease, or in front of the crease, but nobody able to tuck that one away. Yager with a shot. Goes off the side of the cage. Here's Meow with it now towards the top side of the ice. Looking for the way to fan it down the straight. Hits Noah in stride off the forehand. Trying to get this one out in front of the cage. Here's Meow shooting. What a save by Krooks. Kept on the ball. And he'll send that one off the backhand and out of the crease. A good try to collapse on it. The chef down in the kitchen looking to cook it up like Martha Stewart. Here's Yager with it now. Top side trying to get this one away for the boys in teal. Nice stop there by Noah. Yager kept low. Here's Milk with it outside of the slot. Back out to the point over to Krooks. Krooks near side. Jiving. Top side goes off. Yager in the net it goes. What a shot. Oh, the reflexes of a feline down there on the ice. Krooks might not have meant that to be a pass, but Yager says, I see an opportunity, and I'm going to take all of that one home tonight. Twenty or A minute 20 into this first period of action, it's already 1-0 Pittsburgh. Yager on the far side of the ice, trying to get this one through a J-Man boy. J-Man boy getting a piece. Milk near side finds Krooks. Krooks here. Neutral zone. Throws this one down low. Noah catches that one off the forehead. Sends this one near side. A J-Man boy shoots. He scores. And he makes it one to one. The Neapolitans aren't going silently into the night. They're not going quietly without a fight. Tied up here in the first shot. Goes barely whizzing by off the near side. Right from the drop of the puck. Pittsburgh looking for a little revenge shot there. Here's Meow with it. Near side hits the window. Goes off uh, Noah over to Krooks. Top side Yager. Pulling, shooting. Nice save there by Meow. Sent to the far side corner as it lobs its way back out. Neutral zone. Krooks goes near side over to Milk. Milk gets past one. Forehand pass down low against the end wall over to Yager. Yager here trying to dance his way top side. Off the back end. Fans on it. Comes back into his realm to the near side. Milk with a shot. Near side and wide. Here's Meow with it once more with a minute or two minutes 50 to go here in the first period of action. Yager, near side, rifles this one around the wall over to Milk. Milk here fakes the forehand, takes this one down center lane, stopped by a J-Man boy, shooting, scoring off the top left corner. And that's about as beautiful as a shot as you can get. Krooks able to pick his pocket right off the back end. Yager throwing the goaltender around. Meow's not going to be happy about that one. Three goals into it. Pittsburgh leads it 2-1 to one here in the first. Jeff, a J-Man boy off the back end. Look for the shot. Nice save the right crook. Sends off to the near side. Out off the window. And Meow will get a piece, but not enough. He'll trail after it. Here's Meow with a now back behind his own goal line. Leans top side. Looks for the passing lane. Yager collapses on him. Chef shooting. Nice save by Crooks. Goes off the far side and barely wide of the post. As he picks it up, looks down to the near side. Crooks challenged by a J-Man boy. Gets past him. Gets the step. Doesn't take the pass. Goes off the near side. Nice stop there by Noah. Yager recollects out to Crooks. Top side over to Milk. Milk at the red line. Forced to retreat off the bobbled puck. 2.07 to go here on the first. J-Man Boy off the back end. Hits Milk on the way through. Noah after it on the near side corner. Back out to the point. Meow off the back end. Back down low. Finds his way off the hip of Noah. Noah off the back end. Yager off the side of his own cage. Looks for Crooks. Top side over to Milk. Milk here with an out. Nobody really to pass it to. That's wide open. Finds his way down to Crooks off the near side. Cuts it back across to over to Milk. Back to the sender. And he'll send this one down and in. Crooks hot after the puck. Top side leads Yager with it. Back out to the top side point. Milk off the back end. Finds Crooks shooting. Nice save there by Noah. Sends off to the near side wall, and Meow will collect his thoughts. 1.36 to go here in the first. Captain of Napoli with the puck now near side. Noah shooting. Nice save by Crooks off the back end. He's going to lob this one down into the offensive zone. Meow the first man to it. Yager gets better body position, though. Sends off to the near side. Meow here with the puck top side. Off the forehand. Looking for the shot. Nice save there by Crooks again. Crooks having to stand on his head here early on in game number one. Keeping his team alive. Throwing out to Milk. Milk here tries to hand this one off to Yager. Yager, forehand. Stopped by J-Man Boy. Hey, J-Man Boy, top side. Trying to find a little bit of loose room to work with. Here's Noah with an out. Cut back over to the near side. Meow, forehand pass. Down low to the chef. Back out to the point. Lost over to Milk. Milk through Yager to Krooks. Under a minute to go here in the first period of action. Only one goal separates these two teams now. 
Noah chopped loose. J-Man Boy collapses on him, forces the issue down low to the near side corner of the Pittsburgh zone. Sheffer Napoli finds his way to Meow. Meow on the defensive side, going to bring this one back out and around town. This does not feel at all like I thought this game would be. The team on the left side of your screen, if you're just tuning in, was the fifth seed out of the Pro Division. Meow polling, shooting. I saved there by Crooks. That one sent back to the neutral zone. The team on the right side of your screen was the first seed, the favorite. Uh, maybe second to Plymouth to win the chip this season. Noah on the far side, looking to make this one a little pass over to Meow. Not able to send that one around as he throws that one right back to Noah. Noah, not normally the three starts to break up. Shooting, scoring, and Meow finds himself another one to capitalize and equalize. Great pass by Noah. Nobody picked up Meow in the near, or on the far side of the ice from our perspective. 17 seconds into it. We're all tied up like a hog in a rodeo. Auger wins the faceoff back over to Crooks. Here's Crooks with an out onto the near side. Off the back end with 10 to go. Milk here pulling, shooting off the near side of the cage, and that one whistles into the boards. Here's Meow with five. Top side, Chef not able to collect that one, and that will do it for the first period of action. Two to two, our score here in the Viper Zone in Pittsburgh, and both these teams not backing down by any stretch of the imagination. Walking into this one, some people in, in the expertise of the Slapshot Premier League were going to say that Pittsburgh was going to walk away with this series. Last time these teams met up, it was a mercy roll for Pittsburgh both times. The first game being 12-2, second game being 13-3. Um, Nobody had any money or merit on the Napoli ability to play against uh, the pressure that Pittsburgh was going to put down tonight. But I think we've seen just exactly the opposite, at least so far here in this matchup. But we'll see what the second period has in store for us. Everybody's ready to rock. Everybody's ready to roll. We're back down on the ice here for the middle chapter of play here in game number one. Pittsburgh right side, Napoli on the left. The puck is dropped and the game is back underway here in the first match. Here's me out. Top side, out to Noah. Forehand. Knocked loose by Yager. Milk here tries to collect, goes off Noah. Yager kept back downtown for the boys in red. Crooks here after this one off the back end. Nobody really to pass to. As Chef took the near side wall and Noah forced him down to the corner. Noah with a shot, goes off. Yager sticking wide. Crooks near side, finds Milk. Milk shooting, scoring. An empty cage and a true shot. Brings Pittsburgh back out on top. 22 seconds elapsing into the second period of action. Huge play. That's 12 seconds. I don't know how to do math. Bricks to the near side, a forehand pass out of the zone. Milk here pulling, shooting, scoring again. Nobody picking him up. He's just sticking it down right where it hurts. Milk doing what he does best and that's hit the net. He's making it four to two and making it difficult for the Neapolitans to think about that C word that everyone's thinking about. Here's Yager with the puck to the near side. From his own blue line, cuts it across over to Milk, shooting off the side of the cage and wide. Here's Meow with the puck now. Meow, weighing his options. Looks towards the top side of the ice for a solution. Stick check, loosens it up, here's Noah. Noah shooting, nice save by Krooks. Krooks off the near side, Chef all was able to tuck that one away. Milk able to get a stick in there in the nick of time. Meow sent back downtown, Chef after this one. Krooks as well for their respective hockey clubs. Finding his way towards that top side of the wall. Noah here with an out. Pulls it off the back end. Not able to get that one out in front thanks to Yager's hip. Chef to Noah. Shooting save made by Kriegs. What a read. Holy cow. He saw three pages in the future of this Dr. Seuss book of a game. Kriegs awarded another save even though I don't think it was really warranted. Here's Milk with an out trying to dime this one back over to Kriegs. Kriegs to Yager. Near side pulling. Shooting off the near side and wide. Here's Meow with the puck. Looking towards the top side of the ice. Milk there trying to collapse on him. Noah getting the handle on it on the far side wall. Throws his one near side hoping for Chef to uh, be a little bit faster. But uh, the speed's capped in a game like this. Kirk's topside, Milk slapped away by Noah, finding his way back downtown for Pittsburgh. Here's Kirk's with it now. Kirk's here for the Vipers, trying to get this one out of the defensive zone with a pass across the ice over to Milk. Milk pulled off the backhand. Noah there slaps it loose. Noah back on the bike, trying to get this one through the neutral zone. Chef of J-Man, boy, topside, pulling it off the backhand over to Noah. Not able to tuck that one past Kirk's back in the crease. Yager to Kirk's. Kirk's off the backhand, trying to get a passing lane to open up off the far side. Off the forehand, cuts this one near side over to Milk. Milk here with an out. Off the forehand, shooting. Nice save there by Meow, sent to the far side wall. Kirk's tucking this one down low. Chef here picking it up for the boys in teal. Down to the near side, looks to favor Meow. Meow off the backhand, stopped by Milk. Milk here trying to find a wraparound attempt, but not able to do so through the Neapolitan's defense. Here's Chef with the puck near side over to Noah. Noah here looks for the pass out in front, hits Yager instead. Yager down low, sends that one corner to corner over to Milk top side. Milk with a point pass, but no longer. Looks for the pass out in front. Chef gets a piece, and Noah will dump this one down and in for the Neapolitans. 2.23 to go here in the second chapter of game one. Here's Yager with it now. Yager slapped away by a J-Man boy. Back downtown over to Krooks. Krooks here. 
Trying to fake out Chef. Got him the bite twice. Off to the race as we go. A forehand shot stopped by Meow. Meow out the other way. Off the backhand. Looking for the shot lane. Hits the bike of Crooks back where it was parked. What a chance gone by the wayside. Chef here with it now. Down low. Goes off Yager. Over to Noah. Noah here trying to pick it up where he's picked, putting it down. Will he be able to find this passing lane top side? He will. Chef at the point. Shooting near side and wide. Crooks. Bank to himself. Off the backhand. Trying to get this one past Noah. Noah not making it easy for him. Crooks at his own end wall, finds some elbow room topside, rips this one downtown, but not able to hit Yager in stride. Here's Meow with a puck near side, trying to find his way back out to the neutral zone. Chef here has the shot lane, hits the face of Crooks, somehow doesn't bounce off of him and in. That angle looked like it should have, but uh, I'm just a lowly commentator. Crooks shooting, nice save by Meow off of Milk, and he tucks it in. If at first you don't do it, try again, you might happen. Great forehand shot. Very hard to handle, but he was fully aware of his capabilities, and he's bringing peace and prosperity to this new empire for Pittsburgh. 5-2 to two now the score here in the second. Who's got the next one? Milk off the backhand to Yager. Nice stick check by Noah. Throws this one out of the way of Harmon. Gives this boy some time to breathe. One twelve and ticking. Here's his Crooks. Trying to get past the J-Man boy. Able to do so. Off the backhand. Tucked over top side over to Milk. Milk shooting. Nice stop by Yager, unfortunately. Crooks shooting. Nice save by a J-Man boy. Here's Noah with 60. Near side to Meow. Meow off the back end. Throwing this one downtown over to Crooks. Crooks here towards the top side of the ice. Throws this one over to Milk. Milk here trying to find a way through the weeds. Finds his way off over to Noah. Noah shoots scores. And we're back within two. Where opportunity comes and knocking on one side. Eventually he'll go to the other. Great pass by a J-Man boy. Hitting Noah on the dime. And he doesn't miss those often. Just under 50 to go here in the second. Three fives our score. Here's Crooks, looking down towards the near side of the ice. Throws this one down, a long bomb just wide of the cage. Here's Meow, near side, finds his way to Noah. Noah off Crooks, 30 seconds to go. Crooks tries to free that one up, goes up Meow. Noah here pulling it away, backhand, shooting, scoring! And another one into the drop of the bucket of the Neapolitans. 26 seconds to go here in the second. A great pass, Chef there, the insurance marker to set the pick against Yager. And Pittsburgh's defense had no faith in the back check there. 24 seconds, one's the difference. The boys play on. Kirk's with it now. Down to the near side corner of the Pittsburgh zone. Gets it out to Milk. Milk off the back end. Forehand. Looking for the dangle out in front. Shooting. Scoring. Oh, what a play. Oh, somebody put that one on the TikTok. Six to four. Now the score. Milk doing them dirty. Off the back end. Made it look as effortlessly as Sean Kingston wooing a girl. 12 seconds to go. The difference is back to two. My goodness. Pure untapped skill at the fingertips of the controller. Milk topside, shot wide of the cage, three seconds. And that will do it for the second period of action. Two's the gap at the end of two. One period to go. Neapolitans had a lot of positivity coming out of that last one, even though the difference on the board might tell you otherwise. 13 sh 15 shots to 12. This is the first time I've seen Napoli outshoot Pittsburgh in a very long time. But, uh... Meow making the saves he needs to. Five out of the six. Milk scoring the goals he needs to. Six out of the or uh, four out of the six. Both players are all six players ready to rock. All six players ready to roll. We're back down on the ice. Pittsburgh in the red on the right side of your screen. Napoli in the teal on the left side. The puck is dropped. The game is back underway here in the last period of action in game number one. Chef on the far side. Looking to start this breakout for Napoli. Off the backhand. Has the cut across. Goes off. Milk's tip of the stick. Goes down low. Meow to Noah. No off the backhand. Stopped by two red players. Towards the top side of the ice. Tries to free that one up to a J-Man. Boy, Milk hot on in his pursuit. A nice save by Crooks off the far side post. Saw the shot lane. Absorbed it like a sponge. Here's Crooks. Out in front. J-Man boy scoring. Oh, just barely able to get that one over the goal line. Just by the hair of his chinny chin chin. He brings this one back within one. Six to five. Now the score. Napoli doing God's work down there on the ice. Crooks to the top side, lobs us out. No, meow with a takeaway off the forehand. Shooting off the post. Crooks able to tuck that one off the back and back behind his own goal line. Just barely making it out unscathed from that one. 45 seconds into it. Napoli's putting on the pressure. Here's Milk of the Now. Forehand, backhand, pass to Yager. Yager top side has to uh, take a second to recoup. He looks to de uh, deke his way through the traffic. Very difficult task to do in the pro division, no matter who you play up here. Here's Crooks, cuts it across. A Jamin boy, shooting, scoring, and we're tied. Six to six, a flubbed pass on the defensive end, and Crooks might be feeling the nerves. 
I saw Chad called out earlier, laugh track by name, and uh, it might be fabricating itself. Milk shooting, saved by Noah. Noah, top side, meow. Looking to strike where it hurts most. That's the scoreboard. Meow, taking his time, not in a hurry to make a mistake. He misses, Milk here near side, pulling, shooting, ah, save made, no, it goes in. I don't believe it for a second. I can't believe it. It made it all the way across the line. Six to seven, now on the board. And the Pittsburgh Vipers back on top. I don't know about that one, Chief. Milk, trying to get this one through. Yager, the first man to it. Milk, helping his boy out. Noah, off the forehand, sent down to the far side after the sticks collided. Here's Kirks with an out. With three minutes, 22 seconds remaining here in the final chapter of regulation. Here's Krooks, top side, pass to Yager. Yager fans on it. Meow gonna try to get after that one, pass back over to the chef himself. Cooks this one up top side, off the stick of Meow. Goes off Noah, Yager's directed wide of the cage. Unfortunate. Noah, Yager to chef. Yager out in front, finds his way back out to the neutral zone. Here's Krooks with an out. Krooks at the red, chops this one down low. Yager tries to find a song to sing down center lane, but not able to find his footsteps to get there. A J-Man boy, top side. Meow, down low, looking for the area pass to Noah. Noah there trying to get the bank pass to himself. Kirk's here with possession, though. Nearing that halfway point of the third period. Kirk's here, pass top side. Milk here, pulling, shooting. Save made by Meow, challenging the shooter. Coming out in a big way there. Rookies take notes of that one. Here's Chef, back in. Noah off the hip, thrown top side, back out to the point. Meow, near side, finds his way back over to a J-Man boy. Forehand, shooting wide of the cage. Here's Milk with it once more for the boys in red. Off the backhand, pass across the grain over to Crooks. Crooks here from the red line. No passing lanes open, finds one. I don't know how that happens. That's, that's some pro talent right there. I don't know how he could find the opportunity, let alone make that thread of the needle pass. Milk just sitting on the far side doorstep, waiting for a trick or a treat, and I think it was the first one. 2.18 to go here in the third period of action. And Pittsburgh showing up in a big way. Milk top side, pulling, backhand. Trying to get this uh, stick to stick to the ice. Not having a whole lot of luck getting that uh, getting that shot released. But the intimidation factor was enough to uh, let a few seconds leak off the clock. Pittsburgh on the defensive side right now. Here's Yager. Napoli finds Chef with a stick. Taking this one back down low on the end wall. Forehand pass, topside point, finds Noah. Shooting, near side, off the post. And that one plinks over to Meow. Meow shooting, goes off Yager. Kept it alive in the crease, goes off Crooks. Noah shoots, scars! And out go the hats for that man. Seven goals for Napoli, three goals from Noah, and Meow just putting the pressure to the house, and they're going to leave the puck there. Fifteen goals into it, only one's the difference, with a minute 45 to go in regulation. Meow cuts this one across over to Chef, goes over his stick. Yager gets a stick check involved. Noah and Krooks do battle with the stick. Here's Noah. Krooks goes over to a J-Man boy. Noah chopped out in front of the cage, goes off Yager and off to the far side, the race is on. Here's Meow with the puck with a minute 24 to go here in regulation. Top side stopped by Yager, gets a piece of it top side. Trying to loosen that one back up for Pittsburgh. Here's Milk, off the back end, whipped down to the near side. Crooks here, back out at the point, finds his way to the red line. Yager, shot goes off a J-Man boy over to Crooks, down low Milk. Here's a backhand pass, stopped by Meow. Meow to the neutral zone, Crooks there, fakes him out, goes back on the defensive swing. Looking to set up the breakout. Forehand shot goes off Meow over to Noah. Near side. Finds a backhand shot. Wide of the cage. 60 to go. Krooks. Milk. Forehand. Backhand. One man back. Shoot scores off the post. And that one planks in. Milk. The short shot, short shot difference maker on the ice in a match like this. Able to net yet again another goal. Great poise. Great positioning. And another great shot to make it 9-7. to seven. Milk taking his time at the red line. Topside Yager pulling. Backhand shot saved by Meow. Goes back out top side. Goes off Kruks to the far side wall as they battle this one out. 38 seconds to go. Two goals now. The gap. Neapolitan's going to have to put the pow to the wow. Kruks top side. Stopped by a stick check by Meow. Shooting just wide over the stick of Noah. Noah back out to the point. Finds a J-Man boy. A J-Man boy pressured there by Milk with a little Beyblade action. Finds the puck back loose over to the captain of Napoli. Meow top side. Noah with a forehand. Not able to send that one packing. A J-Man boy trying to keep the pressure alive. Crooks down low in the corner with 17. Goes off Meow, top side. Milk picks it up. Looking for the forehand shot. Another backhand try. Not able to find the shot, but I think he was just looking for the time to tickle out. Goes off of the shot. J-Man boy low. Finds Noah. Backhand out in front, and that goes in. There's three seconds and a dream. Oh, I don't know if that was intentional, but I'll consider it calculation central. A J-Man boy getting the final say on that one. Three 
seconds remain, and that looks like it'll do it. A great way to end the game. Uh, if you're going to end a game on a loss, you might as well do it that way. Napoli might not have gotten game one under their belt, but they sure did have a lot of good things to talk about during that first game. 8-9 the score. Pittsburgh leads the series 1-0 now. As so we walk into the next matchup here in a few moments, the shot totals were immaculately uh, different from what I was expecting walking into a match like this. 25 shots, 8 goals. Napoli played a fabulous game on the offensive and defensive side of the puck. Pittsburgh were tried on the defensive side of their efforts as well. Of course, Meow, nine of the team's 10 saves was the rock they needed in a match like this, and he's going to be tested again here in a few moments. But Noah, hitting a few shots, missing a few others that he should have made. The 19 shots between a J-Man Way and Noah were was a tag team duo, duo not a whole lot of people were expecting. Um, of course, Krooks leading the pack with 14 saves out of the team's 17. It's going to be wild here in game two. Either way, all six parties ready to rock. All six parties ready to roll. We're back down on the ice for this one. Don't know what's going on with the scenes, but we're going to pretend like nothing is happening and everything is, in fact, fine. All right, we're back down on it. All right, that was, that was weird. I don't know what happened there. I'm going to be honest with you. Pittsburgh leads the series 1-0 here in game two. We'll see if they can tuck away the series or uh, if we'll have game three. But Napoli needs to win this game to extend their season another 15 minutes. Whether or not they're able to do it is the question on the ice right now. Yager felt a little shaky there, there in that first game. He's still trying to find his mojo back with the Pittsburgh Vipers. Milk was on vacation for quite some time. Did not get, the, not, did not get to play a lot of slap shot with the boys in red here tonight. But uh, as the series goes on, I assume he's only going to get better reconnecting with uh, his teammates after a, a long trip like the one that he took. Griggs here with the puck now for Pittsburgh. Back behind his own goal line. Looking down towards the near side, a forehand pass. 4.06 to go here in the first period. Meow takes it away, shuffles near side. A J-Man boy looks for the give and go, but nobody there in a teal jersey to take the go with them. Here's Crooks near side, Milk off the backhand. Shooting, hits the side of the cage, and that goes wide. Here's Meow. Meow in trouble. Sends this one for refuge near side. J-Man boy getting that one out of the defensive zone. Yager and Noah, the two men back to try to collect that one. Crooks breaks free, top side to Milk. Milk shoots, scores, an empty net. And a solid shot once again to the team's best goal scorer by the stat lines at least. Milk able to do a lot of the push and a lot of the pulling and a lot of the scoring. 340 to go here in the first. Pittsburgh leads it 1-0 because of it. Milk near side. Goes off Chef. Back down low to Meow. Meow top side looking to lean with a rock with it. Will he ever stop with it? Yager says yes. A Jamie boy says no. Brooks near side, a J-Man boy back out to the point, finds his way to Meow. Meow off the backhand, pass top side. Noah here collects it off the forehand pocket, but not able to get that pass released because of Yager. Milk tries to help out the boys in red. Yager going to send that one back down on the defensive side to Crooks. Crooks top side, tries to get Chef to uh, falter behind on the trip. The bank pass out of the zone, finds a little bit of turbulence on the near side wall. A J-Man boy, Milk, Yager gets involved, goes over to Noah, an empty net. He's just going to walk it in. And we're tied here in the first. Just under three minutes to go here in this first period of action. Nobody with the lead once again. They're keeping it close. They're keeping it tight. It's going to come out and pay dividends probably later on in the matchup. Nice save by Meow taking this one top side. Through the weeds finds Yager. Noah, forehand pass, not able to collect it. Was a J-Man boy. The stick in the wrong position. A, forehand, a backhand pass over to Noah. Not able to take that one out in front thanks to Crooks. Crooks down low for Pittsburgh. Two man by Noah and a J-Man boy. Finds the passing lane back for Napoli over to Meow. Meow in the neutral zone. Takes his time. Looks to abide his efforts. Forehand pass. Cuts it across the green. Noah topside. Chef here with it now. Chef off the back end. Sends this one down the far side wall. Noah stopped by Yager. Yager here off the back end. Sent down low to Milk. Milk with 2.25 to go here in the first. Crooks picks it up. Top side. Yager not able to swing that one in. Noah. Off the backhand for Napoli. Finds a backhand pass across the ice over to Chef. Chef down low, trying to take this time back out to the point, trying to find a little refuge with his captain. Milk stealing that one right back for Pittsburgh. Finds Crooks topside. The former uh, Ocean City Typhoon sends this one down the ice. Tries to find Yager. He'll have to battle it out with uh, Meow. Near side Milk. Topside Crooks. Crooks back over to Milk. Backhand. Forehand. Shooting. Not able to send that one to go. Chef awarded that save. Sends off to the near side wall. Here's Meow with the puck. Minute 48 to go. Noah, Milk, off the hip, goes off Chef to the near side. Yager, stick check, able to free that puck up for the passing lane to open to Crooks. Here's Crooks with it now. Back in, down the length, finds his way to Yager. Yager tries to get that one top side, and Meow sees it, sniffs it out. Digs that one back down to the near side. 
Sheffield J-Man, boy, down the near side straight, looks for the passing lane. Yager tries to take it away, goes off milk, top side, loosened up to Yager. Yager, forehand, shooting wide of the cage. Sheff, near side, off the wall. Crooks sniffs that one out. Back over to Crooks, backhand, shooting, stopped by Sheff, goes off Meow's backhand to the top side corner. Milk trying to get this one back for Pittsburgh. Meow with puck now for Napoli. Meow towards the top side, tries to get this one away from the opposition. Noah here with the puck now, forehand pass into the no man's lane, goes off the body and in it goes. Pittsburgh in the lead with 101 on the board. 2-1 Vipers. Noah playing with fire with that pass. Meow was not able to take enough of the momentum off the puck to keep it from crossing the goal line. And the difference is on the board now. Milk back in. Stop. No. What a save by uh, Noah on the far side post. Noah cutting this one across the green down center lane. Stopped by Yager. Thrown down low. Meow getting a piece of that one sent off to the far side. As he tries to take his refuge with him. Off the forehand, passes this one over the stick of Crooks. Yager takes it away, goes off Meow. Meow pocketing that one off the forehand. Looks for the shot lane, goes off Noah. Back out to the point, a little give and go. Stopped away by the Pittsburgh defense. Here's Yager, topside Crooks. Looking for the pull down to the near side. Hits both posts and comes out to Meow. Meow off the forehand, pass to Noah. Noah shooting, scoring! And the Neapolitans are back tied at two. Oh my goodness, heartbreak on one side, heartbreak on the other. Pittsburgh fans are in distress after that one. 26 seconds here in the first. We're tied at twos. Good shot, goes off the end wall. Here's Chef with it now. Chef top side, meow off the back end, just wide of the cage. Here's Noah, 10 seconds to go. Yager, top side for Pittsburgh, trying to get this one out of the defensive end. Chef getting a few swings of the stick, hitting a few of them, not all of them. Nice save by Meow, kept down low, and that will do it for the first period of action. Both teams giving it their all, but nobody able to send themselves out as the leading horse in tonight's race in game two. Pittsburgh, nine shots, two goals, great defense. This is more akin to what we were expecting walking into a matchup like this here tonight, but uh, we'll see how they got, we'll see what they got for us here in the second period of action. All six parties ready to rock, all six parties ready to roll. We're back down on the ice. Pittsburgh right side in the red. Neapolitans defending left in the teal. The puck has dropped, the game is on. Time once again is back underway. Pass top side, Milk with a shot. Nice stop there by Meow. Jeff, wide of the cage, finds Noah top side. Back out to the point, finds Meow shooting. Stopped by Crooks, sent off the forehand down for a goal, but Meow getting a piece of it down in the neutral zone. Keeps that one from getting through. Top side, finds his way Noah. Throws that one out for an area pass to a J-Man boy. He'll have to battle with Crooks for it. Noah out in front, goes off Milk. Meow shooting, nice save there by Crooks. Not given the save, but awarded the block on the stat sheet. Chef goes out, Milk takes it away. Shooting, scoring, and the Pittsburgh Vipers with a long distance call and a solid connection. 42 seconds into the second period of action. Find themselves on top, three to two. Noah pulling, shooting, far side and wide. Crooks pocketing this one. Looks towards the top side of the ice. Milk there, electing to take the puck under his own volition. Top side again, over to Crooks. Stop by Chef, shooting, scoring, and we're tied again. They thought they were cooking something up, but the Chef was not in their kitchen. He was the one with the puck. Great stop, great pull, great poise, and a great shot. We're tied at threes. 59 seconds into the second here in game two. Meow, taking this one top side, throws this one off the wall. Grooks here picking it up on the defensive end with 3.50 to go. Grooks trying to find a way around to J-Man Boy. J-Man Boy not giving him anything easy to pass to. The reason there's so many lateral passes, oh, that's a goal. That just goes in. That's just how slap shot be. That's, it was open. And uh, he, he definitely it did, in fact, take the shot. And he did, in fact, hit it. 3.40 to go, Pittsburgh now leads it, four to three. But if you look at the defensive side from Napoli, they always take the straight, and that's in. I don't, it, that's, there's just another one. Sure, cool. Yup. Riveting, 3.30. Pittsburgh leads 5-3. Noah looking for this two on one. Over to Chef, Chef takes it, shoots, scores! And there's a nice passing play for those fans out there. 321 to go. And the Neapolitan showing us what talent looks like. 
Great pass by Noah. Waited for Crooks to bite on him because when you're the last man back, you really have two options. Do you get scored on or do you get a pass and then scored on? Damien Boy over to Noah. Noah back in, looking to feed this one near side. I think he did. I don't think he meant to do that, but uh, I'm I'm just not Noah. Great shot goes off the side of the cage. Here's Meow with the puck. Yager takes it. Nice shot attempt goes off Meow. But if you watch the breakout from either side of the team, the defending team always takes the straight pass away no matter what. Kruk's right there, took it away. Over to Milk. Milk off the backhand forehand. Nice shot, but Meow with a better save. Yager almost able to find a way to push that one through. The defense just too tight. Kruk's top side, sends into the corner. Here's a J-Man boy with it. Milk, open that, shoot scars. And another one on the board for the boys in red. Leads it by two now with a 6-4 difference here in the second period. Sometimes the puck bounces your way. Sometimes it doesn't. And on that one, Milk taking all the rewards he was given and leaving none of it to chance. 2.30 to go here in the second in game two. Milk shooting. Hits the side of the post, and that one goes wide. Here's a J-Man boy with it. Starting the breakout for the boys in teal. Top side. Nobody down the straight, but they'll stick check with each other. And it'll follow its way down the crooks. Down over to Chef. Chef here back in his own defensive end. Stopped by Milk. Milk down low in the corner. Trying to fight his way through the weeds. Goes off Milk. Crooks back downtown over to Milk. Milk off the back end. Yager shooting off the side of the cage. And that one goes wide. I thought Milk or uh, Meow got a piece of that one. Yager shooting. Meow with a save. Pittsburgh just put an onslaught of offense from every form and facet of the ice here tonight. Finds Meow. Meow chipping. No, almost it would have sent it in. Oh, it would have been something of beauty. It would have been like Picasso. I like it. 148 here in the second. They're drawing it up on the whiteboard here tonight. Crooks gets past one. Pass down the straight over to Milk. Milk off the back end. Yager pulling. Hit check. Not able to send it packing. Noah there standing tall back between the pipes. Pass near side. Milk here pulling off the back end. Not able to get shot released through the defense. That Napoli set up. Yager with an empty net. Misses wide off the near side. Milk goes off Meow. Meow with a few stick checks. Tries to get this one through. The boys in red. Yager. Crooks. Nobody's able to tuck that one into the bed. Yeah, back in the crease. Shooting far side and wide by Chef. A J-Man boy. Yager near side. Milk with one to beat. Has two to do it. Back in shooting, scores! Barely able to nickel and dime him to death on the far side post. Makes it seven to four for Pittsburgh. And that's about a tough of a, as tough of a shot as you're gonna get in the Pro Division. One minute 14, middle chapter of play of game two. And the difference is now three. Are all these pros controller? I think the only one on the ice that's not controller is Yager. But I could be wrong. That was the last time I checked the, the ranks. Brooks near side. Milk here with an empty net. Off the backhand. Shooting. Scoring. And there's another one. Eight to four. Pittsburgh just found a little uh, a little cherry to pick off the tree down low. The Apollos' defense playing a little too aggressive on that back check. That three goal lead has grown to four. Will they be able to maintain pressure and maintain uh, their composure here tonight? Crooks near side, Milk here picking it up, backhand, shooting wide of the cage. That one goes far side. Noah to Meow. Meow off the backhand, stopped by Chef. Here's Crooks with it now for the boys in red. 36 to go here in the middle chapter of game two. Reverses that one near side. Yager across the grain over to Noah. Noah there taking that one away from Napoli. Finds his way to Meow. Meow with 30 seconds to go. Noah, forehand, loses it. Crooks top side. Tries to get a little bit of elbow room to work with. Noah, the first man up on this back check, trying to make the most of his uh, cut across. Taking that passing lane away, not able to do so. Here's Milk with it now down low. Tries to get past two defensemen, but not able to do so easily. Meow near side. Noah has an empty net. Will he hit it though? Forehand waits for it. Pass shot near side and wide. Noah point. Meow shooting. Nice save by Crooks. That one goes off of J-Man Boy on the exit velocity, and that will do it for the second period of action. Napoli at four. Pittsburgh at eight. Here in the Viper Zone in Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania. Both these teams not pulling a whole lot of punches. Pittsburgh coming out showing us more of their familiar colors in, a, in tonight's second game. And uh, whether or not they'll be able to keep it up here in the third period, we'll, uh, we'll know here in a few seconds. We're back down on the ice here for the third and final period of possibly the semifinals. Pittsburgh right side in the red. Napoli on the left side in the teal. Napoli need this win if they're going to prolong it. And they find a way to get on the board early. Noah, a forehand rifle from the pass by his captain. Down low, a hard angle shot, no room for error. Oh yeah, baby, jackpot. Six seconds into it, three's the gap. Now stop by Yager. Meow downtown, looking to take this one from the corner. Milk finds Yager off the near side, passes that one over to Crooks. Crooks 
Off the forehand, shoot, it goes in. Oh, just barely not able to take possession away. And Pittsburgh's back out on top by a four. Kruk's able to hemorrhage that one through with nothing but sheer willpower. 9-5. 11 seconds into the third. Meow goes off Noah in the corner. Here's Meow with it once more towards the top side of the ice. A forehand pass softly over to Chef. Chef off the forehand, back end, shooting off the far side and wide. Here's Chef with it once more. Goes off Yager. They battle with the six in the far side corner like Anakin and Obi. One did in episode three. Goes off of Milk, down low to Meow. Meow here with it now. 45 seconds elapsing into this third period of action. Both teams with one goal so far. Yager to Crooks. Crooks near side. Weighing his options. Down the straight finds Milk. Milk down on the enemy goal line looking for the pick of the pocket but not able to find the cream of the crop. Meow sniffs that one out. Goes out to Crooks at the point. A J-man boy. Noah pinch him along the wall. Finds his way to Yager. Yager stick checked away by Meow. He'll have to trail after that one top side. Meow going to throw this one down and in. Does not like to be the first man to the party but rather the last to leave. Crooks top side with 347 to go in regulation. Crooks not in any rush. Gets it to Yager, out in front. Meow takes it away. Meow off the back end, not able to get past the defense easily. Goes topside, milk shooting, hits the post, comes down. Chef able to scoop that one out. Yager picks it up, backhand shot, goes wide to the far side cage. Here's Crooks, here's Meow. Yager gets it out in front, forehand shooting, saved by a J-man boy. Goes off Noah, he's going to shuffle that one along down Center Avenue. As Crooks picks it up off the back end, stopped by a J-man boy. A J-man boy tries to get it out of the defensive end. Yager with a shot, goes wide of the cage, a little heftily. Goes off Meow, Noah shooting, far side and wide. Oh, that would have been fabulous. Shooting goes off of the face of Crooks. They find a way to get it back out in front. Crooks trying to keep this one down low. Noah, Chef collapse on the wall, trying to get this one away from the boys in red by any merit possible. Yager out in front. Milk gets a stick check. Not enough, and Meow just finds a way back in. Does he not have the stop button bound? Three minutes into it, it's six to nine. Nice. I don't believe you. I don't believe that man. He says he doesn't have the stop button bound to the keyboard or mouse or the controller or whatever he uses, but I don't believe him for a second with a, with a play like that. Yager, Milk, trying to take this one downtown, looking for a little revenge. Noah, Meow. Meow to the near side, trying to pull this one off the back end. Yager taking that one away, top side for the boys in red. Shooting, empty net, not able to send that one home. Milk getting a few stick checks on the last man back to keep that net open, just not able to hit that shot when it was true. Crooks getting this one down center lane. Meow takes it away to the near side. Nobody to pass to, will lob this one instead. Here's Crooks with now with 2.28 to go here in the third. Crooks off the back end, pass softly from the stick check of Noah, finds a J-man boy, then to Yager. Noah gets back into town, shoots, scores, and we have 10 out on the ice for the Pittsburgh Vipers. The four goal lead back intact and every struggle that Napoli has made to get back in this game, Pittsburgh has stomped out the flames once again, but the boys will play on. Crooks with a panhandle, Crooks near side. Tries to get this one around a J-man boy. Backhand pass goes off Meow. Meow backhand trying to get this one around the opposition. Kruk's not making it easy. Goes over to Yager. A J-man boy trying to pick this one up in the neutral zone. Meow goes off Noah. Noah goes topside Yager. Or uh, a J-man boy not able to get that one through. Throws that one down north ways. Yager here with it. Kruk comes back for it. Forehand. Backhand. Looks for the pass in front. Goes off Meow. Meow downtown. Will it hit? No. It'll go wide off the far side just barely. Pittsburgh with possession. Yager stopped by a Jamin boy. Near side. Crooks here gets this one through. Goes off Meow. Near side. Crooks once more. Shooting. Nice save by Meow. Meow with a minute 38 to go here in the third. Backhand pass goes off of a Jamin boy. Great save there by Crooks. Back between the pipes. Going off to the near or off to the far side. Here's Milk with an out in the corner. Goes down low to Crooks. Crooks at minute 28. Yager. Empty net. There's a little style points on it. Finds his way off of Meow. Down low. Yager once more with it. Off the forehand. Back in. Near side. Looks for the wraparound attempt. Not a whole lot to shoot for. Milk. Point. Pass down into his own defensive end. Here's Kruis with it with a minute and 11. Pittsburgh not in a big rush to give the puck away. You can't get scored on unless Milk. Oh, that goes in. That's just unfortunate. I think that's the last nail in the coffin, and it sucks that it's that one. A minute five to go here in the third. Yager throws it out in front, and it just goes off Noah in a very unfortunate way. And uh, that, that sucks. That sucks. Kirks goes off Yager. Meow to the top side. Gets a pinch off the wall. Finds his way over to Noah. Noah at the point. Forehand pass goes off Yager down low. Here's a J-man boy. Bank pass looking for Meow. Nice shot, but not able to hit it. Kirks gets it low. Pass to himself twice. Kirk's near side, nobody to pass to. Tries to cut this one down center lane. Finds a forehand pass over to Yager. Yager from the hip. Finds a forehand trickle near side. 
Down along the wall, wants to a J-Man boy. Over to Meow, Meow with 30 to go here in regulation and possibly the season if uh, God doesn't intervene. Crooks near, Yager to Milk. Nice stop there by Meow, sniffing that one out. Top side, Crooks to Milk, shooting. Far side and off the end wall. Here's Yager, not able to get that one through a J-Man boy. J-Man boy to the top side, gets past Milk, goes off Yager, down low. Milk with it once more with 10 seconds remaining. Off the forehand stop by Noah. Noah to Meow, goes off the back end and gets the save for it in the process. 25 shots, 11 goals. The Pittsburgh Vipers are going to the finals. My goodness, what an offensive onslaught by the boys in red here tonight. And uh, a well-deserved victory, might I also add. They hit their shots when they needed to. They made the most of their scoring chances, and they are going to be in for a ride when the finals come around. Pittsburgh 11, Napoli 6, the end score of the last game, the second game in this best of three. Pittsburgh Vipers, congratulations. Congratulations also to the Neapolitans. That is the closest I've seen a, pretty much any team come from uh, putting it down to the Pittsburgh Vipers. That first game was absolutely fabulous. They started off to a rocky beginning. Same as the second game. But they, they hunkered down. They stayed in it. They didn't let the morale get the best of them. They, they pushed to the very end. And they... They get third, they, they're tied for third. We don't have a third place game. So they are technically the third place team in the Pro Division here for season number nine. And uh, the Neapolitans, I do believe, had one of the best comebacks from last season. The pickup by a J-Man boy, absolutely a fiend on the ice for the boys in Seal here this season. An absolute, um, he is to the Neapolitans what Laugh Track was to the noobs, I feel. It's just a different position. But uh, the Neapolitans, 11 shots, six of those going in. Pittsburgh Vipers, more attuned to what we're expected to see from the Pittsburgh Vipers whenever it comes to the stat lines. 27 shots, 11 goals. Last time, the, the, the one game that sticks out in my mind most about the Pittsburgh Vipers was the one Yosemite Grizzlies game back in season five, I believe, where uh, I think they registered 50 shots. It was somewhere around the ballpark of 50. Or maybe that was against the Columbus Clappers in that semifinals of season five. If you have not watched the Columbus Clappers and the Pittsburgh Vipers in season five semifinals, please go watch it. It's one of the best slap shot series that, that has ever happened. I will I will put $10 that you cannot show me a better series than season five. Out, slap shot rebound. Slap one, it was definitely season two's Clappers Vice, but that's neither here nor there. Anyway. Crazy, crazy series. I, I enjoyed that thoroughly. Three minutes of uncontested puck possession for the Pittsburgh Vipers, and we felt most of that during that third and second period of action. A minute 48 with the puck uncontested on the Neapolitan stick. How many how many of the 16 saves on Napoli do you think came from Yao's department alone? I, I want to see numbers. I want to see what people are thinking. For the Pittsburgh Vipers, Krugs had six points tonight. Had the majority of saves, teams four out of the five of the team's saves. Had the majority of possession time. Two minutes, 20 with the puck uncontested on that man's stick. Out of the total, three minutes. Kirks, absolutely the, the rock that kept the glue together here for the Pittsburgh Vipers here tonight. But um, Napoli, 16 saves. Denied access more times than they did not. Um, Milk, 11 shots. Yager, 12 shots. I don't know how Yager had 12 shots, but only two goals. I've never seen 10 shots be denied from any one man alone. Maybe Milk's just better. Who's to say? But um, good stuff here tonight. And Meow had 11 of the team's 16 saves. An absolute fiend back between the posts. An absolute menace down with Dennis. And uh, one of the best defensemen that this league has ever seen. Meow, three points, 11 saves. A minute with the puck uncontested on his stick. The majority for his team. An absolute great player. Absolutely amazing guy. And uh, one of SPL's finest. I, I'm, I would go as far to say. But, um, you know, Napoli, great end of the season. Not going all the way, but it's farther than I've ever gone. And uh, that much I have to commemorate. But uh, that's going to do it here on the SPL Network here tonight. It was a fun night to watch. I don't know what this screen is. Do you like darkness? If you ever wonder what darkness looks like, it's before you right now. If you never blinked before, this is what it looks like. But um, that's all I got for you here tonight. Thank you for hanging out. Watch some good old-fashioned slap shot with me here this afternoon. You could be watching the NHL draft, but you're here instead, and I appreciate it more than uh, more than you know. But uh, thank you for all the big names in red here tonight. Irvion, Eli, J.S. Tronics, Min Snoda, uh, Gubby, M-Dub, Unglued Snail, Manny, Q-Silver, Cloudy, Davo, and Renard. Longtime supporters, if you want your name on this end screen, all you got to do is sub to the channel. Um, base subs get white. If you're subbed for a while, you're in blue. And then if you're some, if you somehow make it into the uh, the elites club, that just means you've done a lot 
for the league, for this stream. Most of the proceeds that come out of the stream go right back into the site for funding, domain stuff, and such like that. But, um, yeah, it was a great night of Slapshot. Thank you for the raid, Kazi. I appreciate it a lot. If you haven't watched Kazi's stream, uh, K-A-Z-X-I on Twitch. Go look him up. Go hang out. It's a fun hangout. I, I, I guarantee you'll enjoy yourself. You might even learn a few things. Um, he always answers questions in the chat. He always is very attentive to answering and communicating with the chat from both his TikTok and his Twitch. And uh, that's more than I can juggle. I guarantee you that. I can barely watch the game that's in front of me, let alone read chat as well. But, um... Yeah, it was a good night. It was a good night. But, um, unfortunately, we'll have to wait for the finals. Two captains will get together. They'll draw strings. And uh, if they can find a common time to play, uh, the first place you will find it is in the Slapshot uh, Premier League's Discord. You go to discord.spo.gg. That will get you into our Discord. Or uh, there should be a button underneath this stream if you're on desktop to get you in there as well. Uh, Sign-ups are open. Go sign your team up. If you have at least two other friends, you have a team. Um... The sign-up link is in the announcements channel of the Slapshot Premier League's Discord channel. Don't be a stranger. Be in danger. Or whatever the catch line is that we use. That's probably not it. I, now that I think about it, um, that probably shouldn't be the tagline. But I do like that it rhymes. Either way, um, I'm going to go to bed. It's a little bit past my bedtime. Um, thank you all for hanging out. Thank you all for watching. And uh, hopefully we'll uh, catch you in the next broadcast. But, uh, yeah. What's my sign out? Oh, yeah. Hope you all have a great afternoon, a great evening, and a great night.